guys, welcome back to another video. Before we jump into, today, into today's video, just a couple of things I need to get out of the way. First, one, if you could please hit the red subscribe button down below, that'd be awesome. I'm trying to hit 20,000 subscribers before the end of 2020. So if you guys are a fan of Heartland and want daily Heartland videos and season 14 updates, make sure you hit the red subscribe button down below. You'd really be helping me out and I'd really appreciate it. And I promise to give you guys the most up-to-date season 14 Heartland information that I can find. Uh, the next thing I need to say is I am not at all in any way, shape, or form affiliated with Heartland. I don't work for CBC. I don't know cast or crew. So that being said, nothing I say in this video is confirmed to be happening in Heartland season 14. This video is just purely based on my ideas, my opinions, and my thoughts on things that could make Heartland season 14 even better and more entertaining to watch. With that being said, let's get into today's video. Now, I know when I say this, when I say my next sentence, you guys are going to click off, you guys are going to dislike the video, and you guys are going to leave comments telling me to shut up and that I should stop making Heartland videos. I know that, but just hear me out, okay? What if Amy and Ty weren't in Heartland Season 14? Hold on, hold on, don't click off the video, hear me out. What if they weren't in Heartland Season 14 because they were saving an endangered animal? I've said before, and I will continue to say because it won't change, the storyline where Ty went to Mongolia to save the Gobi Bears is my favorite Heartland storyline and story arc. Why? Two reasons. One, the writing was fantastic. Two, it was something we hadn't seen before. And actually, three, it provided major character development for major characters in the show. Um, so what if in season 14, Amy and Ty were gone saving another endangered animal. I think that this would be awesome for many reasons. One, we know that Amy and Ty have a vet business together. We know that Ty is a fully trained vet and he works with other animals besides horses. And we haven't really got to see him work with many other animals besides horses. And by work with, I mean like operate on and help save them and stuff like that. And we also haven't seen Amy barely work with any other horses besides, work with any other animals, sorry, besides horses. So to see her uh, work with other animals would be interesting because we would see how she would handle working with other animals that aren't horses. And then as well, you have the rest of the Heartland cat, or I was supposed to say cast, but no, characters, um, home with Lindy and taking care of her. And then there's the, how would Lindy react to her parents being so so far away. How would um, Amy react to being away from Lindy for an extended amount of time? Because if they go to an overseas place or uh, somewhere really far away like Mongolia, they're obviously going to be there for an extended amount of time. So how would Amy uh, react and how would she deal with being so far away from Lindy? And if they adopt Luke, how would Luke react to Ty being not around? How would Jack and Lou and Tim and all of them and Georgie take care of Lindy and Lou? And then, um, you know, that would provide character development for the other characters as well, including Lindy and Lou, which I've said before is very important to develop character um, very early in many shows, Heartland included, because with Heartland, um, it is all about building on the next generation. So if you want future seasons of Heartland, you have to develop the younger characters. In this case, it would be Lindy and Luke. So to start developing their character young uh, would be the best writing scenario and the best thing you can do writing-wise for the future of Heartland. And as well, like I said, we would get to see Amy and Ty work together, which is something that we haven't really seen that much of. I think that Heartland right now is too focused on the romance drama side of, oh, you know, who's going to end up with who? And not how can we save the animals, which is what I think Heartland was originally supposed to be. And it's how it was in the earlier seasons of Heartland. Right now I'm re-watching uh, re Heartland with my little sister because she just uh, started watching it. And we are on season four now. And I realized, like, wow, Heart the earlier seasons of Heartland were so much about saving horses and Amy working with them and it wasn't about you know who should who should Lou end up with who should Georgie end up with there was none of that 
romance drama. Well, there was some, but it wasn't dominating the show like it is now. So I think to get Heartland back to its ori original roots of, you know, working with and rehabilitating animals um, would be very, very good for this show because I think that that is why a lot of people watch Heartland. is not for the romance drama. It is for the fact that it is about um, animals and saving them. And I think that that is something very unique to Heartland. So I would love to see them add get back to the roots of Heartland and uh, be about saving animals. And I think it would also, as I said, provide char character development for many characters, Amy, Luke, Ty, uh, Lindy, and so on and so forth. And I think it would just be really, really cool to see Amy and Ty work with other animals. And so for them not to physically be in Heartland season 14, I know would upset a lot of people. So my idea is they won't be in every episode, which is also something different because Amber Marshall has been in every single Heartland episode portraying her character as Amy, so that would be something uh, marketing-wise that is very different. And then uh, Heartland fans would come back every week watching it live on CBC because they're like, oh, is this the episode that Amy and Ty come back and we get to see them reunite with the rest of their family? That is something that we haven't seen before. We have not seen Amy be away from Heartland. So how would she react to being away? How would she deal with it? How would the other characters deal with it? How would Jack deal with it? With Amy being gone away for an extended amount of time. There's just so much possible character development in the idea of Amy and Ty going away um, that I think it would be a shame not to develop it and write a storyline based on that. And adding an endangered animal just makes it so much better because we get to see Amy and Ty work and make a difference in the world saving that animal. So I think that uh, this idea would be a very, very awesome for Heartland season 14. I know uh, Amy is a lot of people's favorite character, to, so to not see her in a couple of episodes might make people upset, but um, I think that if they wrote it properly and gave us, you know, scenes of Amy and Ty in that place working with said animal, whichever animal they decide, um, would be very, very interesting. Just like we got to see Ty work with the Gobi Bears, um, maybe we'll get to see Amy and Ty work with um, whatever animal they decide to uh, go over and help. And then maybe um, as far as, you know, how the episodes could uh, be structured, maybe um, we could see, you know, Amy and Ty on the plane going to that place, traveling to the place, and adjusting to um, that place that they go to to work with the animals. Because when Ty went to Mongolia, we didn't see him travel there. We just saw him there working with the animals, and then as he was traveling back, he got sick. We didn't get to see him on the plane um, adjusting to his life in Mongolia, his first couple of days, anything like that. So if they did that and showed the travel to the place, that would also be something different that we haven't seen in Heartland up until this point. So let me know what you guys think down in the comment section down below. Would you like to see Amy and Ty work with an injured animal? What do you think of Amy and Ty not being in every single episode? Um, I think that this is a perfect opportunity to help progress the storylines as they would be focusing on the characters probably more at home than Amy and Ty, um, just like they did when Ty was away in Mongolia and the main character develop development was on Amy being at home uh, pregnant without Ty. So let me know what you guys think down in the comment section down below. Would you be interested in seeing a storyline like this? How do you think the episodes would work? Um, do you think that it would progress the storyline? So many questions. Only you guys can give me your answers. So let me know your opinions down in the comment section down below. Make sure to leave a like on this video if you enjoyed. It would really help me out. And make sure to subscribe so you don't miss any future um, Heartland videos from me, including the most up-to-date season 14 information that I can find. With that being said, I'm going to go. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And with, like I said, with that being said, I'm going to go. I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.